Hey, thanks for having me over. You mentioned me doing your makeup. Did you still want to do that? Okay, um, I know it's been a little while since I've done your makeup, but also just please remember, I, I don't wear it, so if it doesn't look the best, I'm sorry, okay? <laughs> okay, um, so you have everything over here. Alright, um, do you want to do something fun or like, I wanted to say standard, but that sounds kind of negative, doesn't it? Um, natural. <laughs> I don't know why standard was the first word I thought of. I'm so sorry. Do you want to do something a little crazy? Okay, then we're going to have to go with what happens, okay? <laughs> Alright, so... Wow, you have a lot of new stuff. What are these? Oh. Eyeshadows, okay. That would make doing your eyeshadow a whole lot easier. But no, we're gonna still do something. Do you have like a white one maybe? Could do that as the inner corner, that would make that super easy. Okay, there is one here somewhere. Alright, we'll find it. Um, yes, I did get my hair done, thank you. It's a little bit shorter and my bangs are more bangy, but keep falling in my face, so sorry if I'm looking at you like between hair. <laughs> yeah, okay. Where should I start? Do you want a primer on? You don't have like too much redness going on. I know I have like pinky tones in my skin like that, but I don't think you absolutely need it, but if you wanted the primer... Okay. Um... Oh, I saw a sponge in there. I thought, I thought that's where it was. Alright, so we'll apply that. are clean. I just washed them before I came over here. Okay. Did you have another primer? Or was that the only one? Okay. Yeah, I was hoping, you know, <laughs> that you would tell me if I didn't need to use the green one, but we're using the green one. <laughs> How have you been? It's been a little while since I've seen you. Oh, okay. That's exciting. So it's not like a new job, it's like a separate, um, like a club. Nice. This one goes on dark, right? Or did you need me to mix it? Okay, I see. Okay, well that's a good way to get like everyone working together and stuff. Of course, they have to opt into it if they want to participate, but I think that's a really positive thing you're doing. Just a little bit there, too. Okay, so I'm going to mix these to get the right shade, right? That's what I thought. I 
how did you come up with that? Was it just, um, like, an idea you had, or did somebody help you? What do you talk about every time you have, um, a meeting? <laughs> Is that the right term? <laughs> Get together. Shindig. Okay. Yeah, if it were, like, too work-focused, I can see how everyone would kind of get bored of that and then probably not want to participate. It makes getting to know everyone fun. Yeah. Good, good, good. Okay, so I've blended that quite well. I'm gonna just take it down your neck a little bit. There we go. There we go. Yeah, so you've been very busy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, um, I, I've been keeping up with my stuff, uh, but I've also went away for a little bit. I also went away for a little bit. <laughs> to visit my grandma. Nothing ser like nothing serious is going on. Just a nice visit together. Let's see which one of these do I want to use? Do, 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 do. This one. Yeah, we played games, we did usual things made dinners together. It was really fun. Just a nice, like, mental reset. I think I'd like to use this one. Yeah. Oh yeah, we, um, what did we make? I can't remember the name of the second dinner we made, but we did make like beef stroganoff the first night. Well, the first night we had dinner, the um, first first night, we got like a late lunch and it was decently sized. So we were quite full. We just had a little dessert before we went to sleep. And that was good. And then, yeah, we had beef stroganoff. And it was like this Italian angel chicken or something like that. It was a it was a chicken dish with angel hair pasta, but it, it had like, I know it had angel in the name, Italian chick, angel chicken. It must have been like that or so. But... That was good, and it's quite easy to make. So, my mom tried some of it, and I think that's gonna probably become something we have quite regularly. Um, just because it was really easy to do, and it tasted really good. Now, you have this blush that we typically use for you when we do your makeup, but I saw you had some other ones in there. Let me look for those. Oh, you're gonna take a trip soon? Where are you gonna go? Oh, wow. Okay. So, like, are you gonna fly there then? Nice. I've still never been on a plane. I'm kind of excited to go on a plane though. Like, it, it's a mixed feeling, you know, eventually. Not like it's set in stone yet, but... Ooh, I kind of like this one. It's warm. This one's kind of cool. A little too cool. So how long is it then? Like, how long is the flight? We're gonna do this one. 
Oh, okay. I, I thought that was going to be a lot worse. But it's not. It's not too bad. Alright. Yeah, I think that's good. There's a lot of fuzzies. A lot of fuzzies today. Sorry about that. Are you going with anyone or are you going alone? I couldn't help myself. Have you traveled alone before? That's what scares me. Yeah. I like I like to know where I'm going, like have a feeling, and then I'll probably be okay, you know? But like not knowing and throwing myself somewhere I've never been. makes me super nervous. Super nervous. But maybe one day. Maybe one day. I'm just gonna kind of dust that around with this. Spread it out a little bit. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, like I said, that, um, makes me nervous, but it's also like kind of exciting. I'm excited for you to do that. Well, of course, you know, like, you can always call me if you get lonely. How long are you going to be there? Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, if you get like homesick or anything, lonely, just want to talk about something that happened, of course you can give me a call. I'll listen. I'm still trying to find the um the white one you mentioned for the eyeshadow. I might have to like do some more digging in there. You may have something that exploded in there because I picked up something and it was a little tacky. Yeah. Oh, I didn't do concealer or anything. Not that you really needed it. No, not not like down here anywhere. Maybe maybe like you have a little something up there. I should be able to take like the fluffy brush and kind of blend everything back out. Smooth it out. Let's see. Just up there. Let me blend that in first. Where is So are you going to like pack super light then, or are you going to pack as much as you want and pay for the extra <laughs> to go with you? Like what, what are you going to do? How do you travel like that? Because you said like a week and a half. There we go. Ooh. <laughs> oh, I've always wanted to like learn and practice how to, uh, do the really, like, precise folding and packing techniques, you know what I mean? Like the ones where they put whole outfits together, roll them up, and it's like a little, like a Swiss roll, you know? <laughs> oh. Oh, I've not heard of that one. You'll have to show me. You'll have to, like, FaceTime me or so when you, when you pack that up. Do you have any more highlighters? I'll just stick with this one because I think it'll go nicely with the blush. Yeah, there we 
go. And so that's going to be coming up, right? You don't have to bring me back a souvenir, especially if you're going to be packing that lightly. You do not have to do that. <laughs> I would hate to be the one person who asked you to bring something home and it didn't fit in your bag. And then you had to pay extra to get it back or so. So I, I told another friend this story recently. I sometimes forget about it because I have I have this giant llama. Um, it's a stuffed animal. And it's currently in storage in, in the garage, but I um, my dad used to bring us back stuff when he would go on business trips. And it was, it had to be, it had to be like the year that the Emperor's New Groove came out or something like that because I was obsessed and, oh, I thought that went in there, but it doesn't. And so, uh, I asked him to bring me back a llama. I wanted a stuffed llama. That's all I wanted. And then he... That's not really white, is it? No. I, you know, was really excited about it. And he ended up bringing back a llama. But it was huge. It was about this, well actually it was probably bigger than me at the time. Um, it, it's a nice thing to put on the bed, like literally spread all over the bed. Um, stuffed animal. And, uh, sorry, give me one sec. I'm trying to think about what I want to do as well. So he got it home, had it hidden, at least I think, in one way or another, maybe behind his back or something like that. Um, and he was like, I got you a llama. And I was like, okay, cool. I'm like, yeah, thank you. And I saw the llama. And it, it was big. It was the size of me, like I said. And, um... He then said that the llama had to sit in the seat next to him on the plane. It had to have its own seat. It was that big of a llama. I don't know if I want to do any of these from the conspiracy palette. Maybe we'll do like a mix, because you have the shrink palette too. But yeah, so. That was a souvenir I asked for, and then it ended up being a lot bigger than I expected it. So, I'm not going to ask you for something, because I don't want that to happen again. I feel so bad. <laughs> it was a nice surprise, though, yeah. That's why I still have it. I would not get rid of that llama with the uh, dedication he had to getting the llama. We cannot get rid of the llama. Okay. Oh, I really like this purple. That's a nice purple. They don't have names though, do they? <gasps> okay, this is kind of subdued. I know we didn't want to do something subdued, but like for some reason I'm feeling this purple and like this, it's got... It's like... It is purple. That one is purple, but it's got like a 
a bronze sheen with it, you know, or something. You don't care what I do? Okay. All right. Well, then we're going to do something like that. I will kind of, if you want it crazy, I will do something crazy with it, okay? But, um, let me get the brushes. I took them out, and then I put them down, and I forgot about them. Did you want contour? I didn't see the stuff to do the contour. Oh, okay, it's in there. Okay. Alright. So, there is this nice matte purple. We'll use that as the base, okay? Use that as the base. And then I'll start going over it with the other colors. The other purple shades. Shades and shimmers. <laughs> okay. Just gonna like buff that out now. Get it more along the lid. some nice like look at that pink look at that sparkly pink oh, that would be a nice look as well I'm thinking things okay I'm gonna do I'm I'm, I'm gonna make this work it's gonna be purple and pink the thought's evolved, okay? The thought has evol e bleh, bleh, evolved. I'm gonna do the pink one now, like more up uh, by your brow bone, like work that up, blend that in to the purple. Again, this is just the base right now. shimmery purple. I'm gonna place that more like the inner corners, I think. Were you still seeing, um, what was their name again? that happen? I think I need other brushes. Maybe I shouldn't have asked then, I'm sorry. Yeah, Valentine's Day is not a good day to, not a good day to do that to someone, is it? No, it's not. How, how rude. How considerate. Oh, gosh. Okay. I'm doing the pink. Pink is a good deal, just higher. Oh, your best friend from school. Were you that close with them, though, still? people do that to you and um it's definitely not fair 
and not justified, but makes you wonder, doesn't it? Makes you wonder. I'm sorry I brought it up. I did not know. Okay, do this for the pink. What's the shimmery pink? I'm gonna kind of do a line of it in the pink over here. to yawn. I think it's because I've done a lot of talking today and I'm quite tired just from, you know, being away over the weekend and everything. Yeah, it was, it was relaxed. It's just, you know, I think the whole thing of being away and doing different things is what um is what pooped me out. <laughs> All right, I'm done with this. I really want to find that one you were talking about because I want to put the like it in the inner corner. So let me look for that. So do you have to like see them at work or were they strictly like somebody you met from college? Uh, well, that makes it difficult, doesn't it? So the trip will be a nice uh, getaway from everything. with the look at being like a purpley pink. Oh, where did you get all this stuff? I know that's good of me to ask, isn't it? Oh, is it this one? saying they're supposed to be six. I'm only finding five. Maybe you put it in a bag or something and took it with you somewhere? Set it somewhere. I'm not sure. Okay, we're gonna finish your eyes and then we'll move on to the lips.
Then I'll do the mascara and the eyeliner. So just sit still, please. I'm just gonna get really close to your eye there. And then this side over here. There we go. And maybe I do need a brush. It's definitely not something you'd wear to, like, a family dinner, but, you know, <laughs> works. open or close them. Um, I get kind of nervous when you're staring right at me because I don't want to poke you in the eye, but it's totally up to you. Okay. Alright. Just something small. Do you want a wing with this? If you had white eyeliner? Okay, look up now because I Yeah, I can make a wing. I can make a wing out of it. Kinda has to be drastic for the look so it doesn't get overpowered. <laughs> So, like I said, this is what I pulled out for your lips. Um, this a lovely, like, berry color here. And this shimmery lip pencil is kind of a nice duo. And then I pulled out this lip gloss, but if you think this one is too light for these, then you do have the clear, so that would go nicely. Okay. You line the lips first, right? Is there anything you want to do after this? Because, um, I mean, this did take a little while, but... I could go out for food, yeah. Or, um... Hmm... I don't think if there were any new movies. Let me think. So I'm doing this. Do you like the harsh, like, dip in the cupid's bow there or no? 
Mm. Okay, so I'll make it less like I was just following the line of your lips. Cause you do have really nice lips with the like the top shape and everything. Yeah, I think my mom said recently she um didn't know why everyone was doing such a hard dip. And I'm like, I didn't I don't pay attention to stuff like that, but it was an interesting thing that she said. So I was like, oh. So maybe that is a thing right now. I don't know. Just gonna do this and kind of smudge it out when you smack up together, okay? Yeah, I guess I don't have a preference because I don't wear makeup, so I don't really like know. I just I have a little bit of a dip in mine, but I don't I don't know if it's like I don't know what we were watching. Maybe somebody like really overdid it. But I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, go ahead and smack your lips together. Mix that up however it works. <laughs> the blending process. That looks good. Um, I think you will have to look in the mirror because I don't know if we should do this one or the clear one. I could even do a little mix of both, but I think this will make your lips a lot lighter and I think we don't want to make it too. Because you got that, you got a really crazy, you'll see, you got a really crazy <laughs> pinky purple thing going on there. But you said I could do whatever I wanted, so. <laughs> Oh, that's creative. Okay. Do like a like a dot in the middle on the bottom and the top. Okay. Okay, yeah. We'll end that in. And then just a the clear for the rest of it. Okay. Oh, this is the one that smells like cherry, huh? <laughs> Always makes me think of that, um, Katy Perry song. Yeah. <laughs> Literally every time I smell that smell. There we go, it wouldn't close. <laughs> that is interesting. I guess it does kind of give like a, a center, center I don't even want to say center appeal. <laughs> no, you know what I mean. Uh, center focus? Is that the word? Come to use? I don't know. <laughs> okay. So, uh, how do you feel about the look? Because I know it's like... Okay, good. Good, because I was really worried that you were going to regret letting me do whatever. <laughs> but yeah, okay. Um, mm, mm, we could go out for food. We could go out for food. Maybe we can like walk around a little bit after. Okay. Yes, sounds good to me. Wherever you want to go is fine. Um, I will go get my stuff together and put my shoes back on. <laughs> Alright, I will see you down there, okay? <laughs>